The Ice Dogs and Cleveland Monsters go toe-to-toe -to -toe in the season opener to kick off the 2018-19 campaign. Ice Dogs on the road for the first two games of this season at Quicken Loans Arena. Their only visit to Cleveland all season long as the Monsters now a part of the Eastern Conference, so a little cross-conference play to open up the year for Rockford. Well, this Ice Dogs group has a lot of familiar names and familiar faces, one of them being Ford Matthew Highmore, who we caught up with after practice earlier this week. And, of course, Highmore coming off a fantastic rookie season last year, 24 goals for him, a new Ice Dogs rookie goal-scoring mark that he passed up quite heavily as Tanner Caro reached 21 tallies a couple of seasons ago. So for Matthew Highmore trying to replicate those numbers going into year number two, here's his expectations going in for the Ice Dogs. Yeah, it's uh, it's an exciting group for us. Um, you know, we have lots of guys back from from last year, but some exciting, um, you know, good players that came in this year, good good additions, and um, we're all excited about it. Um, Friday can't come soon enough, and uh, we're looking to get it going. What about style, what about personality of this group? Are you starting to get a feel for that yet? Um, yeah, I mean, I think we're very similar to last year. You know, we have a lot of a lot of good character guys in our in our locker room. Um, you know, as of, of style, um, you know, our game's still going to be the same. Um, you know, it's, it's very r repetitious, but, you know, fast. We want to play fast and uh, move that puck, and uh, we certainly have the, the group to do it. Matthew, how do you improve on year two for yourself personally? What are you looking to maybe add to your game? Um, you know, not necessarily add anything in particular. You know, I want to uh, continue to get better at all facets. Um, you know, probably um, take a little bit more of a leadership role this year. Um, you know, we do have a young team, and um, that's something that you know I'm excited about, and I want to be able to, to help the young guys and you know help our team win every day. So, um, you know, maybe uh, a lot of more of the same, but um, take more of a leadership role. What do you tell those younger guys about adjusting to this league and the style of play here? Um, you know what? I, I, you know, everybody realizes it's just a faster level than, than what you've been playing previously. And, um, you know, you want to make sure that when we're in practice that that puck's zipping around nice and quick. And, um, you know, just so we're setting a tone of how the games are. Um, you know, you're playing with grown men and um, you're not in this. Some guys last year weren't necessarily doing that. So it's just uh, it's just more of a, a physical game. And um, I think that's how you leave it. That winning tone you guys set last year down the stretch in the playoffs. How much does that carry over to this year? Yeah, I think uh, I think it you know carries over quite a bit. You know, we're very the guys that were here last year are very hungry to um, get back to to the playoffs, um, and uh, I think everybody that comes in feels feels the uh, urgency of our group that we want to make sure that we get to the playoffs and then anything can happen there. And uh, as as we saw last year, you know you can get really hot and. Um, then run into a good team. So you want to make sure that uh, you're working hard every day to um, get better. Feels like you got some a lot of bubble guys, a lot of guys that are close to making that NHL roster, pushing for it. Does that make for a different mentality, wh whether it may be even hungrier at this level? Or, you know, you get a little taste of it, you want more, or anything like that that you feel in there? Um, you know, I think that we're all such good friends and, um, you know, coming to the rink, um, our whole group, you know, we want to make sure that we're, we're battling it out every day to get better. Um, and I think as a group collectively, we understand that winning breeds, um, you know, guys getting called up, guys getting opportunities. So um, the more winning as a group we can do, the better for all of us. And uh, that's kind of the culture we've set here in the last, uh, last year and a bit. Matthew Highmore and the Ice Hawks toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Cleveland Monsters tonight at Quicken Loans Arena in Cleveland, Ohio. Puck drop just moments away, and we'll get you the action in just a moment here on Ice Hogs Warm-Up.